what's going on guys, it's Bob Silverlake here, and in today's video we are checking out the Aston Martin Valkyrie AMR Pro I believe it is, uh, so without further ado, yep yeah, it is also Pro, yep yeah, awesome, we're going to go into the festival site and see what customization and everything we've got for this thing, because this does look like a pretty awesome looking car. Aston Martin. So a few months ago, we got the standard Valkyrie. And now we have the AMR Pro. This thing looks insane already. Beautiful looking car this is. One of the highest grip tyres there is and Apparently, this thing is also the fastest car in Forza Motorsport. So, let's see what sort of customization we've got for it on here. We can, I, we can all-wheel drive. Ooh, so I put this up to 200 miles per hour. But yo, that's dope. Um, we're already on the best tyres. We're just gonna fatten them up. We're already in X class. I mean stock was basically very top well is the very top of s2 and uh, we're gonna go seven speed race transmission just so we can have them um, gear options to mess around with we're already on race tires and the only other upgrade is the no restrictor plates Wait, so 215 miles per hour. Is it quicker not to have four wheel drive? Right, it's still quicker having, a little bit quicker having four wheel. But dirt cheap to upgrade. We're at a thousand horsepower. That is crazy. Alright, tuning. I don't really want to mess around with it too much. I kind of want to try keep it standard as possible. I will turn these up a little bit, see if we can get at least an extra mile out of it. A extra mile per hour out of it. Nah. Might just slam this thing to the ground. Hey, where we're gonna leave. Put more central, and that's all we're going to do for this. In the car mastery, we do have 5,000 XP, 10 falls upon points, as well as a standard wheel spin. Manufactured colors we have only got, oh, I was going to say only, we got the British Racing Greens or color, which looks nice. Or we got the Valkyrie colour with the red trim and everything that looks cool. Or the bloom. That does look cool. Only if we could have this green with the red trim, I think that would look amazing. This car has been out for about two days now, so let's have a look at some of the designs. A lot of very, very basic. Alright, not a lot of uh, design choices. And one more thing before we go into the race. This is what we did here. Let's see this engine quick. Very nice. And I think I know the perfect track to test this on. Oh, we have a few new uh, road races. Good to know, good to know. But I think the Colossus would be the perfect track to test this car. So, let's not waste any more time. And do 34.3 miles. 
in the Valkyrie AMR Pro. How well it will this thing handle? Or how well, or should I say, how well will I be able to handle this thing? The old pause and addition here as well. Let's actually have a nosy at the grid. Alright, we do have the old try hard vehicles because I remember these things. It's the fight with the DT62 being extremely good at handling. We have a few Forza editions in here, but Forza editions uh, create quite a battle sometimes. But let's just get strength for the race. I don't know, really give me a run for my money. Oh no, how did I bollocks that one up? Alright, we're gonna put it in the There's one mistake, it leaves too much ground. I'm trying to scratch my nose there as well. This car is insane. I can hear where the hell that is behind me as well, being dead close. I would go full send in the corners, but I don't really tr trust this car enough yet to do that. Or it's the uh, Ferrari F40 competition. Or competition. Regardless, that's an F40 behind me. Yeah, what was that? Was that a Mosler behind me? Jesus Christ, look at that Mosler go. I, I think that's what it's called. Oh wait. Oh no, it might be. You see what I mean? These cars are kind of on the ground. Sort of, kind of. I mean, my driving is very really showing it, but I don't think we can change that. I'm impressed with this car choice, Forza. Oh my god. That was not meant to happen. 
Uh, so, how does it even work this? What the hell? Okay then. Seems like it's a town is a deadly place. And I've just done it again. I have just done it again in the exact same spot. I'm sorry, it's trying to pass me now. Oh my god, not even a Ferrari broke either, Jesus Christ. Ferrari backed out. No brakes. Full throttle. I'm not used to driving cars with this much grip. Alright, I got fourth back. Wait, have if I uh, stop messing up on those corners. We're gonna do a little pause and cheat. Alright, maybe it would have worked if we didn't spin out. What was that, the GT46 or something like that? I don't even know. I may have messed up there, but it doesn't matter. We still have just over, just over half the track left. Ooh, nearly getting pushed off the road. Ooh, ooh, that's a Titan. Oh god. This is probably the most scuffed race ever. Join that three way battle of the head. If I've got a chance of winning this thing. Oh, yeah, this way I'll be lucky enough to get a podium. Gonna be a better turn, I kinda gambled it and it didn't pay off. Well, we took further in podium position now. Oh, I missed it? Oh, come on, Forza. Alright, oh, that time. It's a little slow, little sloppy. I should have braked there, I don't know why I didn't. Oh, that was the only one. Too bad the uh, 
two goals in front are still battling strong and making Nixon no mistakes whatsoever. Oh yeah, again, I'm in the grass. I had the better line. Bye bye. Yeah, Ferraris on the side. Oh no, I've got the bloody notification that pops up on the smart TV screams. But obviously, we've got to look 300 seconds. But it takes up the entire screen. Like, why can't it be something small that pops in the little corner? Instead of taking up the entirety of the screen. Bloody hell. I just had three positions stolen. GG. Alright, oh, there's no need to break there. I got a great chance. That's uh, is this a, actually, is this a bait made? He eyes more for the Stop breaching. There's no fucking need. Oh, that was risky. I missed the checkpoint again. I'm doing fucking awful. Final 
my god, the Ghani Falser edition. Jesus Christ, those cars are on my bumper. And across the line, we've got third place. At least we've got a token position. Almost still got 13 minutes to get around it though. So it's the Coding's XCC GT and Freight that demolished me. I will admit that Coding's is quick. Super fast. But on that note, it is time to end. This is an amazing car. Totally recommend on lock-in. And yeah, I'll see you guys all next time.